my darlings, welcome back to the channel. My name is Wei. You also know us also on Instagram. If you're from Instagram, please go follow me and let's be friends. My tiny subscribers, hey girl, come and grab your seat. So I was currently like editing the apartment hunting vlog, and I just realized I didn't do like a proper intro for you guys. But here's a proper intro. Um, I finally got an apartment, and I love it. And I'm moving tomorrow, so yeah, I'm leaving my friends' place. I'm moving there tomorrow, and yeah, you guys are gonna see the apartment hunting vlog. Like after this, my talking and my intro came. Okay? <laughs> so the apartment hunting process, rather. So yeah, I, in case you do not know, in case you're new here, I used to live in Shenyang, which is the smallest city in China. But now I moved to like a bigger city, one of the hubs of the biggest city, one of the biggest cities in China right now. So I decided to get an apartment, right? So where I was coming from, honestly, I haven't done apartment hunting in my life before. I've been in China for like more than six years, but I haven't done apartment hunting before. Because when I first came, I lived in the dorm for like three years. And when I went to move out of the dorm, I it was it just happened fast, right? <laughs> so I said okay, I was gonna move out of the dorm, I was gonna like get an apartment and so a friend of mine just told me like okay, mutual friend was like leaving, I'm going back home and she wanted to like give the house to somebody else. I was like, okay, let me just come see. The first day I got into the apartment, I fell in love with it and I was just like, you know what, I'm taking it. The next day I paid. <laughs> yeah, sometimes I'm spontaneous like that, okay? So that was how I moved and so I didn't have to have stress like getting an apartment, having to pay agency fee and all of that. I just directed, contacted directly with the landlady, right? So when I hear people about doing apartment hunting, I'm like, oh, I really dread this process. So getting here, I had to do that, okay? And here it is crazy. It's really crazy. It's very difficult. And okay, first of all, I have friends here already, so I just use the experiences to like make my process easier. First of all, I narrowed down the search to what I wanted in an apartment. That was the first thing that I did. So I was like, okay, what do you want? What are you looking out for? So you don't just keep going from different places and checking different places. So I knew I wanted a living room, I wanted a bedroom, I wanted a kitchen, and I wanted space, right? That was a major thing for me, space and storage and the kitchen. So I'm like, I do business, you guys know I do business. I buy lots of stuff for people. I need a place to like put them. I don't want everywhere to be cramped. Uh, so I was like, okay, that's what I needed. So I just, and the pricing, baby. <laughs> This place is not Shenyang at all. Like that was another shock for me because I'm like, why is it this spicy? Why is it expensive? So when I narrow that down, before I talk to the agent, I'll just tell you, show me the house first. Let me see a picture. Let me see how it looks like before I even come and do the viewing because I don't want to waste my time, waste my transportation moving about. Like here is very big. Transportation is very expensive. So that's how I narrowed down my search. So I didn't see like a lot of houses. I just walked with like two agents. Another problem was the fact that normally I'm gonna pull up like a um, a um, a picture of the app we normally use here in China for foreigners that's called the 58 app that's called the 58 app right tell me why I message agents on that app and nobody replied to me nobody answered me I even went as fast taking their number from the app trying to add them on WeChat trying to call them they didn't pick my calls or they didn't reply my messages I'm like what is going on I'm not gonna answer me I'm just like what's going on like what is happening here it was somebody actually gave me this agent that there was only one agent that answered me from that app and that was the first house the first houses i viewed and even had more houses but i was like no the landlords will not rent to foreigners because i'm black they're not gonna rent the house to me so i'm just like okay whatever my chinese friend actually helped me and i got another agent so that's the other houses i viewed right so getting houses here like that app and one person can post one house five people can post the same house and i'm like what is going on so i think the major problems that we have here is this city from my own experience i'm just gonna say up here is the fact that most of the landlords don't want to rent to foreigners if you're black that's like a minus they're not gonna, gonna they're not gonna want to rent to you secondly there are so many shared apartments here like where you guys are gonna be sharing i sorry about that my battery died disrespectfully this battery has no respect for me okay it just died out of the blue i don't know why so another thing i noticed was that there are shared apartments right where people share like common living spaces okay like maybe they share the living room to the kitchen and there's no way i'm gonna do that like <laughs> i just had to like i had a budget right but i had to like up my budget just to get this place that i finally got right because i wanted to live on like honestly i wanted to live in comfort guys i, I, I don't mind paying extra for my comfort okay i'm so sorry but <laughs> I think for the past few couple of days, because the house I got was quite pricey, because I had to up my budget. I've been feeling like a certain way, like am I wasting money? Am I doing too much? But I'm just like trying to just find my actions right. <laughs> so yeah, that's how this place is. It's just different. Shenyang, the price range for houses are between like the house I left was one two, right? But that, now I'm paying like double of that living in the city. But anyways, it is what it is, right? My comfort and I do my business and his space and all of that. So yeah. So anyways, you guys are gonna see the houses I viewed. I'm gonna put the prices as well on the houses. You guys can see them. I didn't view a lot of houses because once I saw the one I wanted, 
I was like, you know what? It's a wrap. Let's wrap this up. And tell me why yesterday another agent texted me like, oh, they got a house. Do I want to come and see? Me? I'm like, please, I'm, I already, I already like got a house. I don't need to see. But the house she showed me was not bad actually. Maybe I'll leave like maybe pictures of what she showed me and the prices as well. So I'm not trying to like discredit. But the place I wanted was like a central area. I think that's why it was like more expensive. I wanted the central area. That's why it was more expensive. But yeah, for the purpose I want the house for, it's gonna serve me, right? So yeah. Anyways, you guys should go right ahead to enjoy the video and watch the video. Do not forget to share, give me a big fat thumbs up, turn on your post notification and subscribe if you're not subscribed. Alright, catch you guys later. Bye. Yeah, I'm feeling anxious, baby, I'm not sure But I can't do it now, my baby, I don't want to know Who do you hear me, the moon is on the moon, like where it goes Moon and I dig to me, I'm not so old, I'm not your joke I'm feeling anxious lately, I don't know Be going to eat, don't I go, baby, think I gotta go Now I need to know my thing, I can't get you to take it slow Moon and I dig to me, I'm not so old, yeah, I'm not your joke It's you, the moon is on the moon I'll travel to the moon. The upper is so good now. Okay, damn right, damn right, nigga. I need me on that life, that life you've been thinking of. How do, how do, Gina, do we jog in my attitude? Suru gets on my shit, go jam on time, attitude. It's you, the money's so good on your boom. I'll travel to the moon, the upper east is so good now. I've been just running the circles now. I just won't last. I guess that you found me. Better no penance, dependent on willingness. Too hard to budge, and I give up. No do I turn and I budge, and I budge too long. Turn to the dark, to the bottom, to the dawn. No one don't care, so I'm falling. Yeah, I'm by the door, I'm calling. Yeah, uh, I'm taking that mind and left you alone. Doing it right, pick up the phone, I'm holding it tight. Tired, I don't know what you're so caught up. You wanna link, I'm running it back. No, I don't know what you're doing. Who do you mean? I'm more like saying, who do you mean? I'm more like saying, it's you. The more you talk, the more you pull. I'll travel to the moon. The upper east is so good now. the houses and honestly the first house I didn't really like it not I didn't really like it so much first of all the guy was even telling me that the landlord is reluctant to rent so far now but the second one was really nice and the landlady I think it's a lady because he called her and she gave like a discount from three thousand something I think it was three thousand three zero six zero she reduced it down to two nine fifty but two nine fifty for that I'm just like this is like my house in share and I was paying like one two for my pay almost 3,000 quiet for that apartment but it was really nice I love like the sunlight in the living room I love the bedroom not so much I love sunlight the kitchen as well it's very tiny the bathroom is small like the door of the bathroom I feel like the living room just took all the whole space and the dining okay it just took all the whole space and they made the bedroom tiny the bathroom tiny the kitchen tiny as well so yeah the first house I saw he said 3,000 the second one he said 3,060 but they reduced it down to 
to 9.50 and if I pay two months I'm gonna get it for 2.9 but and the location is great for me I love the location but the price is quite pricey it's quite pricey not out of my budget and he said the other houses that he has they will not rent to a foreigner they will, they will not rent to a white boy rent so yeah I have to keep searching for houses because that's above my budget. Two nine fifty is too expensive for me. So, anyways, I'm going home right now on my way to the subway. So, I'll catch you guys maybe another day when I have. This is just day one, okay? <laughs> it's looking like it's gonna be a long ride, okay? It's like it's gonna be a long ride, right? So, yeah, I'm going back home right now. <laughs> lighting I have no idea okay hi guys so, anyway guys anyhow you guys see please take it like that okay the sun is not out today so today is day two of house hunting and honestly it's not looking good um, I'm getting frustrated I'm getting quite frustrated and I haven't seen like somewhere I like and the prices the budget is the prices the budget is crazy okay the budget is way the prices are way above my budget but i'm trying to stay hopeful i'm trying to like stay hopeful without finding someone that i like and the prices will align with what i like okay so today is day two of house hunting all right so i'm gonna go check a house right now i'm gonna take you guys like along with me hopefully i feel like i don't know if that's giving like that's gonna be my last resort but it's a loft i don't know any guys you guys see it in the videos okay so anyways just wish me luck fingers crossed up i'm gonna like it and yeah catch you guys later Bye.
I'm done viewing the houses and honestly I'm kind of having hope right now I don't know if you guys can even hear me because this estate is quite new they are still doing construction and it's very quiet but this city feels very quiet and very peaceful as well so I'm done viewing the houses and I don't think it's actually bad but the only problem is all the houses are lofts and you guys know the issue with loft stairs all right and that's the only thing but I'm just gonna see I think I like I like some of them all right it's actually not bad the furnishing is not bad as well it's actually not bad but let's see I don't know if I'll check more houses or not I don't know if I'll still check more but let's just see how it goes okay yeah Just some, just some.